We have a great cafe that's open from 11 to 2 every day and from about 11 to 8 in the evening on Saturday. So come by and see us. Good buddy. Known each other for quite a while. Done a lot of things together, especially when it comes to Pasco Kids First. And I would like to introduce the gentleman that is running for the honorary governor of West Pasco on behalf of the West Pasco Chamber of Commerce, as well as, most importantly, Pasco Kids First, Mr. Doug Saxon. Well, first of all, good evening, everybody. A little healthy crowd we have here today. Um, for those of you who don't know, I'm Doug Saxon. I've been uh, helping out with uh, Pasco Kids First and Healthy Families for a while. My wife, Annette Saxon, is here tonight. Um, she's been with the organization for nine years now, and um, it's always a charity, uh, charity of choice for us. Um, there's a lot of families that need a lot of help, and a lot of children. They really need a lot of assistance. And this program really, out of so many other things, helps out the children and their families. Great, great <laughs> so, I really greatly appreciate you coming out here today to share this time. Have a good evening. Thank you, thank you. That's my man. And that's, that's what you poor Richie and West Pasco is all about the work now. And I would like to introduce the executive director, Pasco Kids First, Mr. Rick Pass. Thank you all for that nice uh, welcome. Thank you, Paul, for being our MC tonight. Doesn't he do a good job? Yeah. Does a great job. And Doug, uh, thank you so much for uh, your work in this. We got into this race a little late. We weren't really expecting to be in it for two years in a row, but Doug stepped up and said, yes, I'll do it. And you can see his passion for what goes on with Healthy Families and Pasco Kids First. So what we do is we help kids and we strengthen families. And I want to teach you a little, a little something tonight if you're game. Are you game? We just adopted a new uh, motto or tagline, if you will, and I want to teach it to you tonight because it's really important and it will help you really remember the essence of what Pasco Kids is all about. Okay? First line, keeping kids safe. Everybody say, keeping kids safe. Okay, second line, strengthening families. Strengthening families. 
Those two things, those two little phrases, characterize everything that Pasco Kids is about. It's what we've been about for 25 years in this community, and it's what we continue to be about today. Um, Becky wanted me to do some tear jerkers, and we got plenty of stories. I could be up here all night um, pulling on your heartstrings and that type of thing. But what I want to tell you tonight is that we have success with the families and the kids that we work with. And kids are safer and families are stronger because Pasco Kids First and the wonderful staff that we have does the work that they do each and every day. In healthy families, the child protection team, and our trauma treatment team, those are our three programs. So let me go back now, circle back to our tagline motto, which I really want you guys to carry out of here tonight. We're gonna to say it all, all at the same time. Keeping kids safe. Strengthening families. Okay, now we're gonna do it right through. Keeping kids safe. Strengthening families. Thank you all for helping us. This is Rick Hess. This is a, it's a phenomenal work. Angelica, I'm sorry, Angelica Chatter. Amos Angelica with the uh, Ruby Ribbon Fashion Consultant. She and I are going to be your co MC. I'm going to describe the outfit. She's going to introduce the other Okay, all right. Well, we are going to start our first couple coming up tonight. Miss Lindsay McCaslin, who is a Dr. Lindsay McCaslin, a dentist here, and she is escorted by Jared Oates, who is an aide to Richard Corcoran. Doesn't she look gorgeous? Yeah. <laughs> so, Lindsay is wearing our mini skirt, and there's a little secret in the mini skirt. There's a little five inch skinny panel going on in there, so a little tummy tuck going on. Not that she needs it, but you know. We can all use a little help in the midsection, and then she's also wearing our cabana tunic and our new polka dot for summer and spring. So, give it up for her. She's just look beautiful, very retro with on. Lindsay McCaslin and Jared Oaks, let's hear it for them. Uh, next up, one of, my, one of our good buddies in the community is Joanna DeLuca from Stylemaker Salon and DeLuca's Fine Jewelry. And she is escorted by the other half of the Bidet team, Mr. Patrick Bidet of Patrick's Career Academy. So Joanna is wearing our race tunic. It's got a little sheer... Um, paneling going on on the side, a little rouging along uh, the waistline. And then she's also wearing her blue, blue capri um, rouge pants. And uh, she's going to come back. We're showing this as a casual look right now, but we're also going to show it dressed up. So you can wear this out during the day running errands. And then you can just change a couple of pieces. And when she comes back, she's going to be ready to go out on the town. Joanna DeLuca and Patrick Benet. Uh, how about one of our wonderful, the Ms. Michelle Baker, our wonderful county administrator. She is escorted by Chopper Davis, the city councilman from Newport Racing, and our Red Nose buddy. She is not wearing a bra. <laughs> She's got um, our Ruby Ribbon signature cameo that actually replaces your bra. It's true. I don't care what your cup size is, ladies. It is true. <laughs> um, She's also wearing our um, lace trim, lace trim tank and sea green. I'm serious. And then she's got our new fit and flare um, ponte pants that are awesome for work or casual in the royal blue. I love it. And her own beautiful scarf to pull it all together. She looks fabulous. Michelle Baker and Chopper Davis. And after that description, I, I can say we have a magic show. Um, <laughs> next coming up, Mother of Four. Philanthropist in our community. This cat, mother of five, I'm sorry, mother of five, 
and a philanthropist in our society, Ms. Kathleen Fink, escorted by Mike Tremina from the office of Gus Bill Rack. lace dressing cream um, it also comes in black but she, underneath she is wearing our new v-neck slip in rose it's actually shapewear but it's meant to be underneath and so you can show it out we put it on a pretty pink rose color this year and she just looks fabulous ready to go out during the summertime out for lunch to the pool anywhere doesn't she look gorgeous Kathleen yeah. Fink squirted by Mike Chimita Mike didn't want to come up on the stage because he didn't want you guys to confuse me and him standing next to each other. Another close buddy of mine, Chairman of the West Pasco Chamber of Commerce Board, and also with Mid Florida Credit Union, Candace Lewin, escorted by none other than King Pitla, Tim Sherrill. Candace is wearing our optic dress. Um, there's a little secret in this dress. So we're going to show you a little secret, a little shaper going on in the dress. A little screaming action going on, but still a beautiful dress, good for work, anywhere, lunch. And, and look how saucy it makes you feel. So you can, you know, hey, she looks great. Thank you. Candace Lewin and Tim Sherrill. Give a nice hand. So I told you it was a magic show. Um, uh, another good part, Ms. Kim McPherson of, of Scott McPherson, PA, escorted by Mr. Derek Pontlitz of Pontlitz Asset Advisors. So Kim is wearing our Manhattan tunic and our black capris. These are our famous leggings, and they do have a five-inch skinny panel on them as well as the other uh, mini skirt that you saw. And uh, this is a great outfit that you can actually wear very casually during the day. We've got it dressed up here to go out on town, but you could picture her in a hat or sunglasses and her sneakers on. Very comfortable. And thank you very much, Kim. Yeah. 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 You don't get to see what's underneath that. Kim actually weighs 200 pounds for that. Our next, guys, our next person coming up here, Ms. Beth Hess, is the, uh, not only the, the wife of our executive director for Pasco Kids First, Rick Hess, but she is the Pasco County Teacher of the Year. Yeah. And she is, a, she is escorted by Matt Guitar Murphy, also known as Mr. Amanda Murphy. Yeah. got our denim leggings on and ladies let me tell you these will replace your denim jeans for sure she's got our Vivian tunic on she's got our <laughs> Stars, Miss Carol Kennard with Hell Tisa, escorted by the executive director of Pasco Kids Force, Rick Hess. So, Carol looks gorgeous. She has got our Ponte Slim Leg pants on. These are great for work or running around. I actually have the same pants on. Um, she's got a versatile tank on, which also has a little secret in there. So, she's got a little hidden shaper going on underneath that tank. And then our leather shirt with the lace trim on it. Beautiful, beautiful. Carol Kennard and Mr. Rick Hess. It is a magic show. Good job, Carol. Hey. Next up, our state representative, contrary to popular belief, from District 36, Miss Amanda Murphy, escorted by our old buddy Terrence McCaskill, the civil engineer. Scoop neck in the back. 
And then if you flip it around, it's a little bit higher up. So it's two different ways. Also, a little shapewear inside, underneath. And then she's got our new fit and flare skirt on in pink rose and just looks gorgeous. And look at those leopard shoes. Guys, I, I, and I apologize, it's Amanda Murphy, thank you, state representative, but it is Terrence McCaslin's skirt. I'm sorry, he told me it was hyphenated. Oh, it's the other way around. It's Terrence Sterrett. Uh, doctor. Not just anybody, but Dr. Paula O'Neill, our own county clerk and comptroller, escorted by Luke, I'm your father, Walker. She's got her fit and flare black Conte pants on. She's got her Ava blouse on. And again, no wrong. She's got her sheer candy in plum going on there. And it just looks gorgeous. Very, very nice. Beautiful. Dr. Paul O'Neill and Luke Walker. Guys, check out these shoes as Paula comes down the stairs. Those rock. Uh, how about Miss Evie Parks, who's now working with my buddy. Rob Hages at Marchman, escorted by our own honorary governor, Mr. Doug Saxon. Very nice. I mean, she's got her black ankle leggings on, again with the skinny band hidden in these, and then she's got, we've seen the Manhattan tunic already. This is with it belted in our new blue color for summer, looking gorgeous. Thank you so much, Abby. Beautiful. Emmy Parks and Doug Saxon. Give him a nice hand. The other half of the Potlitz family is about to enter the room. The important half is Stephanie Potlitz of the United Way, escorted by our own county commissioner, Mr. Jack Mariano. So, Stephanie,
shaper going on underneath, just slim and smooth. Summer. Looking gorgeous. Yeah. 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 Yeah.